Hey guys, so I'm on my way to an interview and I only got like at the most an hour of sleep today because I was so nervous about it. I found out about it last night, so it was really unexpected. It's to um, intern um, for a casting company that is handling the VH1 Pepsi Super Bowl concert. So, hopefully I get it. 80 people applied for it. Only seven were chosen to interview and I was one of the seven. So, Priscilla's looking all cute. My honey bunnies. She helped me do my hair. So, yeah. So that's where I'm headed off to. It's by the beach, so it's like 30 minutes away. But I'm really excited. I hope I get to do it because it would be awesome. It would be a great experience. Yeah. I don't get paid for it, but it doesn't matter. It's about getting the experience, not about getting the money because nobody's going to hire you unless you have experience. Hello, everyone. So I went to the interview for the VH1 Super Bowl concert, and I got it. Yay! Did my kiwis get frozen? No. I oh. just want to know if you want some now. Not right now. No? After we eat this up. So Priscilla got that really expensive tomato. That was $6 for one tomato. Yep. But look how pretty it is and inside. It's beautiful. That's the colors on the outside color. <laughs> and so we're toasting up some bread with some vegan butter. We're going to put some balsamic vinegar. It's going to be great. So yes, I'm super excited about working the concert and that was like the best interview I've ever had. This is dinner for the night. And we're watching But I'm a Cheerleader. It's my favorite movie of all time. I love it. So we finished, we finished eating and now we're still watching But I'm a Cheerleader. If you haven't seen this movie, you should rent it and watch it. The first time you're probably, it's, I don't know, it's, it might be like, this is how Napoleon Dynamite was for me. First time I saw it, I was like, this is the stupidest movie I have ever seen. What a waste of time and money. And I, I never saw it in the movie theater. I bought it because Priscilla was like, oh, I heard it's so good. Blah blah, so I bought it and I hated it. And then I watched it again and I couldn't stop laughing. That's how this movie is. The first time you watch it, you're like, What, huh? This is so stupid. It's like ridiculous humor, and it has like subliminal signs everywhere. So it's super funny. And RuPaul's in it. As a man, that doesn't make you want to see it, then I don't know what will. Second best thing about But I'm a Cheerleader is they have the weirdest music, but after you get used to it, it is so good. It's like totally different. I don't even know where they found it. I think they might have had it specially made for the movie, I guess. I've never heard it anywhere else. 